Hello everyone, King Slayer Koshi, and welcome back to Plants vs. Zombies. In the last part, here we got the Doom Shroom, which lives up to its name. It's one of my favorite plants to use because of just the sheer destruction that it has. It destroys everything in 5x5 five five diamond pattern. The only down side is that once it does its effect it leaves a huge crater where you planted it and you have to wait a certain period of time before you can plant another mushroom there or plant there <clears throat> but yeah for this let's play i decided to do a little bit of a challenge to see i guess the reactions that you guys may have because what i decided to do was make my own thumbnails because for those of you who watched my channel have probably seen that most of my thumbnails consist of the same static wallpaper for said let's play and it's mostly because I don't really have any sort of way to do any graphic designing or anything like that or make my own thumbnails but I decided to make a little challenge to myself because back in the day in uh, middle school and a little bit in high school as well, I was pretty adamant in using not so much like um, any like really hardcore um, graphic designing software such as like Photoshop or anything like that, but most of my time was actually spent using. Um, Microsoft PowerPoint to make animations using the built-in shapes and everything that was built in there. And it was something that I was kind of decently known for in high school when back in my early years. I stopped doing it a while ago because, of course, time and honestly, I didn't really see myself doing much in terms of the game. In terms of like graphic design anyway because graphic design usually isn't a very adamant thing that people want to go out of their way to job oh yeah and by the way there's gonna be an eventual cut soon here because my computer decided to die on me and i need to go charge it there we go and i'm not sure if i also got interrupted as well but either way it did take a while before i eventually went back to got back to the game, back to the level, so there was just an awkward um, pause there where you saw my um, desktop screen, so I needed to edit that out, but anyways, yeah, I've been using PowerPoint to try and manipulate some pictures and see if I can create some unique backgrounds, or, yeah, unique um, thumbnails. It's not much right now, but it's all I got. Maybe later down the road when I actually get a actual decent software for graphic design and do something in terms of unique thumbnails, but right now, <clears throat> this is about as good as I can get. So, if you guys care, just look and let me know if you like them, hate them. Because if you like them, I'll see if I can conti continue to do more of them. If you don't like them, I can just go back to my usual routine of just doing standard, uh, the standard wallpaper thumbnails. Which, I mean, it's not the, it's not that big, it's not that big of a deal if no one likes them. It's just, it's not that big of a deal if you don't like them because, I mean, it's just less work for me. But, I would like feedback. I usually don't ask this because I really don't care too much for it because really I'm just here for fun. If I wanted to do this for money then I would have not gone as far as I have in college and probably would have dropped out a long time ago. I mean I'm a, computer, I'm a comm sci major but I've decided to go whole hog with comm sci. If I really wanted to go whole hog with YouTube there's just so much that I need to do. There's a lot of equipment that I need, and just a whole lot of support I'll need from fans in general that, I mean, I could do if I really wanted to put the effort into it, but at the end of the day, it's just another job. 
And right now, I've already made up my mind of what kind of job I want to do. And besides, there's enough people on the YouTube scene anyway that it's just more trouble than it's worth. So why am I here, you ask? I'm just here for the... I'm just here to have some fun. I'm just here to have some fun and enjoy the show. It may seem like a stupid reason, but... <clears throat> I'm also here for a personal reason as well, I guess you could say. If I ever do make a decent amount of subscribers, I guess I can do some questionnaires and reading comments, asking about and talk to you about my history and everything, but eh. I'll do that for a different time. But in the meantime, I'm just going to be doing what I'm doing right now. Because right now I have my own priorities. And they consist of... Finishing up school and... Finding my place in this world. If you want to hear me get philosophical, you'll just have to. If you want to hear me, if you don't, if you want to hear me get philosophical, you'll have to ask about that later, or I'd have a different playthrough. That I can just do that all together because this isn't the playthrough for that. This is just because we're here to just watch zombies get murdered by plants and laugh at their expense of just how stupid these guys are. Although the sad thing is that, despite how comical these zombies look, I think I've already said it, but these zombies are sadly somehow the smartest zombies I've ever seen in the video game that rivals those of, eh, I think Resident Evil probably beats them out, but... I mean, I'll get points to these zombies for the persistence, but... <clears throat> Note for a zombie apocalypse. Just plan a very, very, very big garden. But in the meantime, as soon as this wave comes crashing in, hey, day now, boys. <laughs> you know, you know, you really want my brains, but you really don't. You know, for people who want to eat my brain so badly, you really don't put in the effort to run. You don't really don't put in the effort to actually, you know, want it. Well, there are some zombies that actually put in the effort to try to want it, but others that there are others that don't really seem to really give a damn about it. Oh yeah, and here's Doom Shroom, by the way. Doom. <laughs> uh, it's a powerful shroom. And I love it. And just because. <laughs> and now we get another note from the zombies. Hello, we would like to visit you for a minute. How does ice cream and brain sound? Sincerely, the zombies. <sighs> These guys never learn. And now. We're at the final stretch where, basically, it's random time. It's random time. Get your random, get your random plants and start planting away. Save your hypno shrooms and save your hypno shrooms, your ice shrooms, and your dome shrooms for whatever gets in the way, and <clears throat> just start planting away. Unfortunately, it makes with this setup, uh, it actually makes it easier to actually make scaredy shrooms useful because you can. I can actually like legitimately make two rows of these things. Even though it's probably not a good idea to make two rows. Oh, 
four doom shrooms. Yeah, it's probably gonna make me forced to use them, but I don't wanna. Doom shrooms are so valuable. But yeah, trying to get use the great busters immediately when you get the chance. And well, just play hey, like you normally would. Because uh, honestly, there's not much else to say. <sighs> just plan strategically, plan to how you see fit, plan accordingly, and you'll be fine. This isn't. <laughs> there's not. There's nothing new to say about these zombies. These we've. It's the same spiel as usual, so. Just keep playing away, and eventually they'll die. Eventually we'll win. Yeah, like I said, this is st still uninteresting right now, but when we get to the next level, I promise you, things are going to get a hell of a lot more interesting. Oh yeah, and a uh, hip mushroom. <laughs> Bye, football guy. Yeah, look at our football guy. Bye, football guy. Thanks to the ice rooms be slowing them down to molasses. They're dead. combination of the ice rooms and the hypno shroom unfortunately wasn't enough to keep him alive long enough to actually summon some more goons. In the meantime, hypnosis and ice shroom. And then spell doom. <laughs> uh I love my job sometimes. <laughs> the unfortunate thing is, every single time that these get, like this is the reason why I can't seem to work with the um hypno shroom. It's like every single time you get the zombie you want, it's always in like the most inconvenient place. Inconvenient place. Yes, inconvenient. Real. It's me. Spell Doom. And with that, I'm gonna go eat. And I'm gonna get the last grave. I should put down the last fume shroom. Put down the fume shroom thing is. Film shroom. There we go. <laughs> and at this point, it just doesn't matter anymore because hey, free shrooms. And with that, we just kick back. And with that. This may be a big wave, but all I have to say hey, is this. <laughs> and, uh, <gasps> and with this, we get the lily pad.
which allows us to play it on water. And now we're in stage three. This is where things get interesting. The Zimes are trying to get through the backyard. And we're going to have to fight them back. Next time. See you then.